Welcome back to another video guys. Today we have an exciting announcement. We got our Bixby travel bags. So we're gonna go over kind of what we can fit inside of here and some of the features that go along with it. So let's jump into it. So we have two straps on here. We have the hand strap that Velcros and then we also have a shoulder strap. You can throw it over your shoulder um, and you can loosen and tighten the length um, on this as well. We're gonna open up the bag and what you're gonna first see is you have these two little um, dividers that you can use to kind of um, compartmentalize your uh, travel bag. So I'm gonna show you how I'd pack this up. So you can fit two motors and two of the PP378 batteries in here. So I'm gonna first make a little divider for the motors. So I'm gonna Velcro this right about there. On this side, right about here as well. This other piece that's a little bit larger, you can mainly use this as a little cushion for the bottom or you could put it in between the batteries. So here I'll first put in, leave my kill switches and remotes out front for a second. So I'll put one PP378 right in there. And then you can put the divider on top of it so it doesn't scratch up. If you have multiple batteries, you can fit another PP378 right here. And then here we have two different of the K1 motors. This one actually has a uh, flip and lock uh, adapter on it. So you, if you are using a SUP, you don't have to take off the adapter every single time. And you can fit two motors in here. So we'll put the one with the adapter first. Mm -hmm. And then kind of just like how you pack shoes in a shoe box, uh, do it just the exact opposite way. And that will go in right there. Up top, you have a zipper compartment. So you could throw your Bixby remotes in here and your kill switches if you wanted to as well you just close it like this. If you have it fully loaded like this, it's gonna be a little bit of a tight fit, but still, you know, close the, pinch the edges a little tiny bit. And you'll be able to fit two motors and two PP378 batteries in there. Um, if you are just using one motor and one battery, you will um, you will be able to comfortably fit um, one whole outboard kit in here. When it arrives, it'll come in a uh, little plastic wrap just like this. Um, a, a special note we want to mention is that these are not uh, dry bags, they're not waterproof. Our whole entire system is waterproof um, and it's submersible. So having, you know, something that's potentially still a little bit wet in um, inside of a dry bag or something will just contain that moisture. So we wanted these to be breathable um, and thus they're not waterproof because they don't need to be because our products are waterproof. And that about sums it up. I know these are really uh, a big ask that some of the customers have been waiting on. So we're happy to bring these bags to you and uh, they'll be on our website and uh, click the link in the description down below and uh, we'll link you to that item. Thank you guys. We'll see you in the next one.